is the most important step in life and should not, therefore, be entered into, unadvisedly or lightly, but discreetly and soberly. In this estate, these two persons come now to be joined together. If any person present can show cause why they may not be joined together in matrimony, let them speak now. That's the quietest I've ever heard. <laughs> <laughs> Kyle, Rachel, I solemnly require and charge of you both as you hope for joy and peace in the marriage state. If either of you know of any just cause why well, you should not lawfully be joined together in holy matrimony, you do confess it. Is it your will to proceed? Do you take this woman to be your lawful wife, and do you solemnly promise before God to love, honor, and comfort her, keep her in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep the only unto her, so long as you both shall live? Rachel, do you take this man to be your lawful husband? Uh, or, <clears throat> it was right. <laughs> And do you solemnly promise before God that you will love, honor, and comfort him, keep him in sickness and in health, and forsaking all others, keep the only unto him, so long as you both shall live? Kyle, if you will take Rachel's left hand, place her ring onto her finger, and as you do, if you repeat after me, with this ring, with this ring I be wed, I be wed, and with all my worldly goods, I be in doubt, in the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Rachel, you will take Kyle's left hand, place his ring on, and repeat after me also. With this ring, I be wed, and with all my worldly goods, I be in doubt, in the name of the Father, and of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Well, inasmuch as this man and woman have in the presence of God and these witnesses consented together to be joined in lawful bonds of matrimony, and thereto have given and pledged their oath to each other, I now, according to the ordinances of God and in the name of the state of Arkansas, pronounce you husband and wife. What therefore God had joined together, let not man put asunder. You may kiss your beautiful brother.